Hey everybody, this is a very short video following the previous videos we made about the in-area monitoring system. Many of us these days use the rack mountable mixers, which are very, very compact and very good. Some people use the Behringer X32, we have the Soundcraft UI24R. The only thing in common with most of them is that they have the built-in router, but they are not very good and they do not cover a very good range. So normally what you do, you connect an external router and you get a more stable signal. So what we have done, you probably can see it here. You see the cable over there? So we just extended the cable to the front and there is this ethernet cable, ethernet connection in the front. So we connect our external router, which is very compact, very you know cheap, small one. And uh, it just opens up like that. And we used to put it on top of the, the case. Uh, but it is not a very good solution. It's flimsy, it can fall over. Uh, it would fall over actually. So what we came up with, let me show you a very simple solution. I think everybody can do it if you use an external modem. You know, we were considering buying a rack mountable router. We found one in Thoman in Germany, but the problem was that that one is 18 centimeters deep. And since this is a shallow case and we have the a power supply in the back with AC adapters connected, we, we we missed one centimeter so it wouldn't fit inside this so we had to go for external router and um, but also it's good that we have this slot free so it can breathe and it's an airflow gap for us but what we came up with is was such a solution very simple let me show you so this is an extender a very simple a boom basically with a clip and there is a tablet mount which goes on top of it basically like that let me put it on here so when you have this one we connect it on the handle of the case like that let me show you so when you have this one you can basically put your modem in it so in few seconds you have your modem mounted the ethernet cable goes from the Ethernet connection to the back and the AC adapter goes to the power supply. With this, we are also future proof since with that model, we would be bound to that model and anything happened to that modem, we wouldn't do, be able to do anything. But with this one, we can put any router that we want. And if anything happened to this, we can buy a cheap one and replace it. So any model we want, we can, and the advantage is it's even higher and it's in the line of sight, which any router has to be. We have a very short Ethernet cable. I think it's a half a meter, very short one, goes from there to the router and the AC adapter also goes to the back and very, very quickly you're ready and your router is ready to be used. So if you have any questions, please write me. I answer everyone and also subscribe to the channel. It helps a lot and I upload more videos explaining everything. So thank you very much indeed. I hope it helps and stay well and play many, many shows. The final thing I just wanted to tell you is just a carry bag. It's a very small carry bag by uh, Warwick, by Rock Bag by Warwick. And uh, the way we pack it is very easy. This modem is very compact, it's very flat and compact. Uh, it goes here. And then the, the AC adapter goes here. And as well as the Ethernet cable goes there, it goes underneath. And the mounting kit goes there as well as the mounting racket. They just go inside, very snuggish, and very small package that can be carried easily with us on the road. Very, very small and handy package. And there are some spare cables, spare, um, Ethernet cable longer ones in case we want to put the, the modem a little farther, which will never happen, but it's just a spare cable over there. Very small, snuggish, and handy to carry. So anytime we go to concert, in just a few seconds, it can mount it on the side, put the router on the top, connect the cables, and you have a great range to cover. Hope it helps. Thank you very much. Cheers.